Hi Sparkles, it's Jordan Sparks. Welcome back to my channel. In today's video, we are going to be reacting to the Angry Birds group dance from Dance Moms Season 8. So if you're interested in that, please make sure to give this video a great big thumbs up. It really helps me out in the algorithm. And if you're brand new to my channel, welcome. If you'd like to join the constellation of Sparkles, please make sure to press that juicy red subscribe button at any point during this video but now would be a great time. And don't forget to tap the bell notification if you'd like to be reminded every single time that I post a new video. And if you'd like me to react to your dancing, make sure to check out my Scale About website. I will leave the link to that down in the description below. And all that being said, let's hop right into the video. I feel like she's right there. Jane and Nina's ballet isn't really up to par with a lot of us. I'm a little worried that she is not gonna know what she's doing. Let's take it. Oh, shade. Advanced, small group, contemporary. Get ready for entry number 89, Angry Birds, 2-2. Wow, those are like real ballet tutus. That was a beautiful partnering between Brady and Lily there. Sarah. If you're going to be pointing out Giannina's ballet technique, then you really need to be making sure to stretch those ankles and point those feet. That being said, I think that Giannina can hold her own. She's doing a great job in this number, and I am seeing strong, straight legs across the board. Okay, group ponche. I'm seeing a lot of bobbling supporting legs just due to unengaged turnout muscles, so that's just going to be needing more ballet classes and really working on that muscle conditioning. And that being said, I'm really seeing some opportunities to really stretch those ankles and point those feet in this group dance because it's in all of the really small, quick petite allegro steps that you really need to quickly point your feet. You only have a split second, but you still need to do it. Kind of sloppy for Lily. She had killed it. I knew she would. What were they right. saying about her not being the good choice for the lead? I think that Gia held her own in terms of ballet in this number. Again, I would say that really engaging the turnout, that note applies to Gia as well. Just as a general note, when you're in a deep second plie, that your knees aren't supposed to be knocking in towards each other, you really need to again engage those turnout muscles. And overall, I think that they did a great job for not being a ballet troupe. I think that they did a great job performing a ballet number at competition. 
I loved the costumes. I did find the tutus to be a bit bouncy and distracting, but overall I loved them anyways. But I thought that they did a great job with this number. Artistically, they did a great job. I saw a lot of fierceness. I thought I saw a lot of energy. I saw a lot of passion. So great job there. Also, a special shout out to Brady for partnering multiple girls in this number. Partnering is meant to make it look easy for the girl, but it's a lot of hard work for the guy and strong lifting. So congratulations to Brady for that. And uh, yeah, let me know what you guys thought of this Dance Moms Angry Birds group dance in the comments below. But I think that that is it for this video. So again, if you'd like me to react to your dancing, make sure to check out my Scale About website. The link will be down in the description below. And if you'd like to shop my Stay Sparkly merch, you can check out the Teespring merch shelf down below this video. Or again, my Teespring link will be down in the description box below. And if you have any other suggestions for videos that you would like me to react to, please definitely let me know down in the comments. Oh, and if you'd like to check me out behind the scenes on social media, you can follow me on Instagram or Twitter. They are both Jordan J Sparks. But I think that that is it for this video. So as always, make sure to be weird, be wild, and stay sparkly, and I will catch you in the next video. Bye.